Captains, if you're a lover of the Boeing 767, then unfortunately I have some sad news for you guys. Now a few days ago, I made a video about the retirement of the 767 from the fleet of American Airlines. Well, to add another airline to the list, Hawaiian Airlines have just confirmed that they will retire their 767-300ER fleet as early as the first quarter of 2019. Now they used to operate 8 of the planes around the month of June and slowly they've been phasing them out. 3 of the planes are set to be transferred to United Airlines and the other 3 will be sent back to their leases. Now this is actually about 3 months earlier than they initially planned but since they dropped their Beijing service, they don't really have a need for the planes anymore and they're also expecting to take deliveries of the A321neos and the A33200s which will be a suitable replacement. But the unfortunate reality is, is that the 767 isn't economical anymore compared to planes such as the A321neo. Majority of their routes are from the west coast of Hawaii and the Neo is cheaper to operate than the 767. As a result, the Neos will open new opportunities in the lower traffic markets that couldn't really support the wide body service. And in addition to the cost savings, the transition from the 767 to the Neo will also boost the airline service. Now the Neo has a seating capacity of around 180 seats compared with the 250 seats for the 767s. And by deploying the Neo on lower demand routes, they won't need to offer as many discounted tickets to fill the planes. Now they also plan to have 7 of the Neos by the end of March. Instead, they began with 2 at the start of the year and the third one didn't arrive until May. They currently have 16 orders for the new planes with 8 already in service and 10 more still yet to arrive. But the airline has felt the consequences of the delays. They trained the pilots to fly the Neos but they didn't have enough work for them and secondly they plan to retire their oldest 767 earlier on this year. They had to do extra maintenance work in order to return the plane to service temporarily and adding costs beyond what the plane is actually worth using a less efficient plane rather than the A321neo. So all in all guys, the A321neo will complement their current fleet of 23 A330s on longer haul routes between Hawaii and the US West Coast. I know there are hardcore fans who will miss the plane and unfortunately it will start becoming a rare sight in the skies, well at least in the commercial service anyway, we know that the cargo sector is currently booming. But at the end of the day that's just how it is, newer and far more efficient planes will do a better job compared to the previous generation of jets. Now captains if you've ever flown on the Hawaiian Airlines 767 then share with us your experiences. Or if you have any other experiences with the plane then share that also. Thank you so much for watching guys, leave your thoughts in the comments below, like and subscribe and I'll catch you guys very soon.